Hi friends, welcome to Live Watch Chennai. This is Mr. Universe. Today I am going to draw the movie poster. The movie name called Mark Antony. This is one of the hit movie in recent time. Okay, now I have the poster print out with the grid line drawn already. So I have made the diagonal grid line only on the face to draw the detailing part. And also I have already drawn the grid line on the sheet because I don't want to spend more time by drawing the grid line. So maybe all of you know how to make a grid line to paper and picture. So let me start the drawing directly. So I have the reference picture on the right side corner so you can check. So I obviously start from here right. For grid line, you no know, matter where you are starting from because you are going to draw on the particular boxes, right? So, whatever you can see on particular boxes, you can draw. That's all. So now I am drawing the face. I mean, outer part part of the face, uh, the gun. So while drawing the picture you can check the picture reference boxes also to confirm where you are drawing exactly sometimes mistakenly we will draw in different boxes so that it will lead to wrong okay so always be careful So you choose particular box and start drawing. So drawing years. Now the outer face outline is over. Now drawing the glasses. So once you decided to draw with the grid line, so grid line must be drawn carefully. If you make a mistake in grid line, then your drawing will come wrong. So make sure that the red lines are properly drawn, okay? Because you are going to draw pictures by the support of the grid line. If the grid line is wrong, then your drawing will be wrong. The grid lines are uh, helping you to enlarge the pictures and also transferring the drawing from one to another surface. The, the diagonal grid lines and uh, as usual normal grid lines are helping you to place the lines exactly where it is so before drawing you make sure from where the lines are starting in particular box you choose any of the nearby grid lines as a support to start lines Sometimes uh, we have to correct the outline by ourselves. So the grid line meeting points and the grid lines are 
the supporting area where you can exactly place the features and outlines so drawing by using grid line is one of the method to make a drawing without any mistake for commercial purpose most of the artists use grid line because grid line uh, brings the outline exactly as you want it now the sketch video drawing is over now we can move on to Vishal's drawing So this is one of the very nice movie of Vishal film career because his acting and uh, the storyline is so good. I'm just drawing the hand and finger. So once you draw the grid lines blindly you can start outline with the support of the grids. So drawing the hand and gloves. So each and every box are uh, very useful. So actually I did mistake uh, on the outline of the face outer. Actually this one is wrong right side I'm drawing. So again I started and uh, I did correctly. The first drawn outline is wrong. The second one is the correct. If you are confused in the box, you just make a mark before you do outline. Place the marks in particular boxes or lines connecting so you can connect the outline wherever you marked later. This grid marker technique will be useful only for those who wants to copy or who wants to transfer drawing from one to another surface. That's all. No use of other than this. So now I'm drawing now.
so take time because don't draw faster lines are very important sometime if you go faster it may come wrong because you will not be so aware of uh, boxes and lines so always take time and do it slowly for the outline for shading you can do very faster because shading is not at all matter the outline is a matter okay so i did eyes both When you are drawing eyes, uh, you must be little more careful, otherwise the eyes may go wrong because this uh, face is not actually exact straight, it's, it is a little bit turned and looking to the right top, so the eyeball and uh, eye shape will be different from normal face. Also lip and uh, moustache. This is new look of uh, actor Vishal. Obviously, to be frank, uh, this face in the original picture also it doesn't look like uh, Vishal, right? Sometimes this type of pictures will be a little difficult because we cannot bring the resemblance of the particular character but the portrait will be nice and good but the resemblance of the person might miss now the shawl face is also over and then shirts and hand to be continue So the beads drawn and uh, the shirt and it's a purely a uh, 70s and 90s look. The costumes and the hairstyle resembles the late 80s or 70s. Shirts and the other detailing will not be a tough at all, so you cannot find out the difference much. So only face and features we got to be careful. But doing when you are shading or coloring that time, uh, you can be much aware of making costumes. So now the visual character is over. Next, Silk Smita. It sees a look-alike, but not sees the exact Silk Smita. So they found one girl with the same resemblance of Silk Smita, so they used her for this movie. So now I'm just drawing from the nose. Actually, this pose with hairstyle and the 
the ornaments on the forehead looks beautiful for this character so started from nose and continuing eyebrow and following that right side eyebrow actually i first of all i thought of doing this on a free hand sketch but i thought okay we can start by grid line also it will be useful for the beginners to start with i can do it with a free hand itself but for the beginners only i'm doing this tutorial as a grid line drawing grid line techniques will help the commercial artist who takes commercial orders from the people who doing who are doing the uh, artwork as a gift items so now the outer face I mean cheek and chin I'm drawing So now the lips are over and chin and uh, hair uh, this picture is very interesting but it takes long time for shading anyway i need to do this by part by part now i'm doing only for outline part as a tutorial then after this I'll start with the shading. So now almost outlines are over. Keep in mind one thing that always make grid line on the paper very light. Okay, don't make it dark. Did you check that I'm drawing uh, outline with uh, purple color pencil because I just wanted to make different from grid line. Obviously, I'm going to do this as a color portraits, so I'm using a uh, purple color. Otherwise, if I'm doing with a uh, normal pencil shading then i'll use normal graphite pencil because color pencil and normal pencil will not uh, combine together so you better always choose your pencil as per the medium that you are going to shade or color okay the next after this uh, the drawings are over after this i'm going to erase all the grid lines right so some of the detailing i'm just improving with hair and costumes okay so the part one pencil outline tutorial with the grid line is over i hope this uh, you're liking this if you like this video uh, please subscribe into my channel and also share this video link to your family and friends they may also learn some new technique to start their drawing okay thank you thank you for watching